What's good everybody? Welcome back to Cadillac Cartoons and today I'm going to show you how to draw crossed arms. Now what you see here is I got a character here and I intentionally left the uh, arms part of the body blank so I can show you guys how to do this specific drawing or pose actually. So let's get to it. So first we're going to start off with the shoulders. They're going to come down. So let's start on this side. They're going to come down like right off of the body. And they're going to be shrugged a bit, so it's going to be a little bit elevated. Like, it's usually right here, but we're going to make it um, come up a little bit. And then the arms are going to come down with this straight shape. And then we can get a stopping point, like, right here. See, and this right here is the elbow. We can now create the actual arm. But let's go down here first, because down here in this area where the arms kind of cross, we're going to make it kind of a cross shape like this. And then we're going to do the same thing over here with this arm, but we're not really starting up here. So we're just basically making a few guidelines to help us when we get to this side. Okay, see? And that way this arm can come up a little bit, but still making that cross shape. And we're going to come in with this arm. So I'm going to make it a little bit curved. Because that's how the arms kind of look. Okay, and then right here is the wrist, so I'm going to draw that in and make a little triangle there. So that's the wrist. So this arm right here can come up a little bit, so we can hide a small portion of this arm that we just drew to make this part visible. So we can do that and make another line here. So that's her hand. And then the rest of the arm. Since we drew the guidelines, basically, the rest of the drawing kind of falls into place. So, here's her torso. And the torso kind of covers up uh, a portion of this arm, because it's a three-quarter view. So we're going to see the torso before seeing the arm. So that's why a lot of it will be covered up. And then, if you want to change the direction of this cross, you can. Like, I'm just making it downward a bit. And then do the same thing that we did over here with the shoulder, like elevating it just a little bit. Okay, and then any other details that you want to add, you can. So that's how you draw a crossed arm pose. If you found this video useful, give it a like and a comment. Subscribe if you haven't and tap the notification bell so you never miss an upload. And I'll see you in my next video.